polarities of the neutron flow, we render his primary weapon system inoperable. Now I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Can we get what about him his secondary somehow? defense grid? Well, a precise shot from the arc's EMP emitters should jam his defense grid just long enough, just long enough, for us to make use of our newly constructed exothermal heat ray pulsator. This would all end with him being disabled for eh, about three minutes, give, and, give or take. Thank you, Power Master. But I haven't gotten to phase two yet. Come on. Or does it seem you would anytime this millennia? All right, Autobots. We need to put our processors together and come up with a plan. I suggest we... Um, you guys might want to see this! This is Mick Shocker with TFR News. We interrupt this broadcast to bring you this breaking news bulletin. A rampaging robot has begun a vicious attack on Stick City. We now go live to our field reporter, Gabby Sinclair, for an update. Thanks, Gabby. And now here's Vortex with a weather report. It's gonna get a little windy! We're gonna need some serious help on this one. I already called G1. He's on his way. But just to be on the safe side, we need to get over there and help them out. Dude, you are a dick! Alright, Primes. The fires of evil once again ignite the dark path toward destruction. It falls to us to stomp out this flame wherever it may burn. For the sake of honor, we will find that flame. And with righteousness, we will stomp the last embers of injustice and evil out. Though the struggles may seem insurmountable, and the goal of peace unreachable, it lies within each of us to accomplish our task of bringing peace and justice to the beings of this world. Now, transform and... Uh, um...